In this video, we will learn the basics of getting started with Jot Blocks in Nintex Assure Sign. Jot blocks are data capture fields in templates or documents that indicate where data will be applied that is passed through integration, where data will be entered by a signer, the format of applied data, where digitized signatures will be applied by a signer, and instructions to end users that will appear when they are walked through the document signing process. Jot blocks may be defined when a template or document is created or edited using the template design page or dynamically when submitting a document through document now webhooks by embedded text tags or XML in the submission, which can be done using dynamic jot blocks. Using dynamic jot blocks will be covered in a later video. Through jot blocks, signers may provide data to be applied to documents by various means, including drawing with a mouse, stylus, or a finger on a touch-enabled device, drawing on a signature pad, through manual typing, by selecting from drop-down lists, checking multiple items in a checkbox group, or selecting a single item from a radio button group. Basic jot blocks are accessed from the right panel of the envelopes configuration page. To implement a jot block into your document, simply click and drag the desired jot block onto the location on the document and drop. Resize the jot block by clicking and dragging the corner of the jot block and adjust to the desired size. You can open a Jot Blocks configuration window by clicking here. This is where you will be able to make common, display, and conditional logic edits. Clicking the trash can will delete and remove the Jot Block from the document. You may also click here to copy a Jot Block. In this video, we learned the basics of getting started with Jot Blocks in Nintex Assure Assign, which allow you to create data capture fields in your documents for data processing and handling.